Okay. James. Eric, you must be, must be delighted with the performance and the attitude of your players and the quality of football. No, anyway, I'm really satisfied and happy and clear. Um, we wanted a different approach and well, we have got that. Can I just ask how you can be so bad at Brentford and so good tonight? What did you do to ch can I ask how you can be so bad at Brentford and so good tonight? What did you do? I mean, surely you said the same thing before Brentford is this week, so what changed? Uh, it's always, uh, you have to find out when you're coming in a club and you have to uh, get, uh, get the, the players know the behaviour of the team and so it really surprises me in, in Brentford and uh, that, is, that is not the way I want to play football. I want to see a team, I want to see players who, who fight and when I talk about fight it's not only about what you're doing out of position, also in position that you have to be brave, brave. and also there you have to invest in runs and I think yeah, we, we have seen that today all on the pitch. Fans, you heard the atmosphere in there tonight, it was incredible. Fans think that is now an Eric Ten Hag performance, that's what they're going to get from Manchester United under you. What would you say to that? Uh, well, <laughs> what, we have a long way to go. And uh, when you are in the process, uh, you have to deal with setbacks, sometimes you also you have highlights, today is a highlight, but yeah, we, we just started. And, uh, what we have to get is, is the way um, um, to, to, to above. Uh, to, uh, we have still a lot of room for improvement, and that is what we have to work for. But I hope that the players now understand that uh, the base is always um, team, fighting spirit. You, you, made, uh, you made a big selection call, in particular probably Cristiano Ronaldo and the captain Harry Maguire. What was your thinking behind both of those decisions? I, we have a squad, and uh, and then uh, we have a way of play, uh, style, but also a game plan. And then you look what is the best approach to to, um, uh, to the game, and that is what we we did today. We do that every game. So today we we, we picked those pl these players, but it can be uh, Saturday can be different, and we need a squad because we have uh, many games to cover and. So if we, if we make a team out of the squad and we stick together as a squad, then we can achieve a lot. I'm convinced about that. I, I, I probably don't want to focus on Ronaldo and Maguire, but just those selection calls, it sends a very big message to the dressing room that no one's place is, is guaranteed week after week. The demand is for everyone, <laughs> also for the manager. We have to deliver. And that, that, uh, that uh, you have to... Uh, you have obligations to, to the club, to the fans, and this is a massive club with uh, yeah, a huge fan base. So we have to deliver that. Uh, we have to be act as a team, and every individual has to give them every day the best. And that is the demand um, for the manager and also for the team. Another back. Um, Eric, if, if that's the way your team is going to play, if that's the way you want your team to play, Especially when the other team have the ball, and Cristiano can't play in, in your team, surely. I think he can. He, in his whole his career, he under um, several managers, he did in several styles and systems. And he always performed. So why he can't do this? I, yeah, and for me, his age is not an issue. If you are young, you are good enough. And when you're old and you still deliver the performance, you're also good enough. I believe in his potential, and uh, such games will give him give him belief. But I think it it, it, it counts for for the whole team. As I see today, the performance of Jaden Sancho and Rashford, uh, you will see they bring so much power um, in the game, and still they can also be a threat and a weapon uh, all the time for the opponent's defense. So uh, I think we have players uh, who, who have. 
uh, a lot room for improvement and the team also have a lot of room for improvement and I hope today is a base and from here on uh, we will improve. Two more, one at the back and then one. Uh, he has won so many trophies in his career, so he knows the road, how you win games, and finally how you win trophies. So that uh, we have more players who uh, who has won already many trophies in their career. So that has to be a guidance for the rest of the team, uh, that uh, that they know, um, that they understand how to win games. And now today we did it really well. So from if you uh, compare it. Uh, with the last week, so we make a step, but that is what you have to deliver every day and every game. Last question. Uh, as Andre Martinez has had a bit of scrutiny since he arrived, was that a, a performance from him that you expect to see week in, week out? In particular, I think he um, certainly got under the skin of some Liverpool players. James Milner, uh, he managed to uh, ride a little bit. Uh, is that the kind of thing we can see week in, week out from him? Yeah, I think that is what he what he is bringing into a squad. Uh, I call it a crinta. Uh, a South American, um, he is, and that is one of his uh, attributes, and he can bring that into the squad in this in this team. But I think you also saw it, for 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 example, in the first game against Brighton. I thought also there he, he brings a really good performance. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.